Hello my cheese, welcome to my channel and in today's video we are going to discuss about the Matsendra Asana. It is also known as half rod of the fish's pose. It is a seated twisted yoga asana and it is named after the great yogi Matsendra Nath who was believed to be the founder of the Hatha Yoga. This asana provides a deep spinal twist and offers numerous benefits to the body and mind. This video I'm gonna discuss about the steps involved, the benefits and the content division of this video. So here's how you can practice the Matsendra Asana. Start by sitting in Padma Asana. Now bring your leg in front of you, keeping your feet together. You can either place your hands within the line of knees or by your side. Now bend your knees and bring them close to your sitting bones or hips. Now bring your left leg under your right leg. Place your left feet by the side of your right hip. And now bring your right feet by the side of your left knee. Here you can bend your spine sitting up tall. Exhale and now bring your left arm. Try to hold your ankle or the feet of right leg. If you are not able to hold your ankle or your feet, you can always keep the hand on your right shoulder your right arm should be at the back supporting your posture and you should be gazing towards your right shoulder keep the breath deep and steady and hold this position for 40 to 50 seconds you can increase the duration as you practice this pose regularly to release inhale and gently find up the twist to come back to the starting position now repeat the same with the left leg and these are all the steps which are involved while practicing the earth matsendra asana now let's talk about its benefit it helps in making your spine more flexible this asana provides deep spinal twist which helps in increasing the flexibility and mobility of whole spine it stretches and strengthens the muscle ligaments and tendons of the whole back improving overall spinal health it also helps in improving the digestion the twisting motion of adra matsendra asana stimulates the abdominal organs including liver pancreas and intestine promoting detoxification and digestion it helps in relieving constipation and improves the functioning of digestive system helps in improving the energy flow in the body the twisted action in the asan helps in activate and balance the energy channels of the body specifically along the spine it enhances the flow of prana known as the life force and improves overall energy level in the body it helps in improving the core strength while practicing the Ardha Matsendra Asana, the core muscles are engaged, supporting the twist. The regular practice of this course can strengthen the abdominal muscle, helping to improve core stability and posture. Helps in stretching and toning of the muscles. The asana stretches the hip, shoulder and chest, providing the gentle stretch in the muscles and connective tissues of these areas which helps in relieving the tension tightness of these muscles and also helps in toning these muscles it helps in stimulating the nervous system the twisting motion in earth matsendra asana stimulates the spinal nerves which can have a calming effect on nervous system which helps in reducing stress anxiety and fatigue which leads to healthy nervous system so these are all the benefits which you get while practicing this asana. Now let's talk about its contraindications. Really to the back and spine. If you are suffering from a recent spinal or back injury, one should avoid this pose. If you have chronic spinal injury or chronic back pain, you should practice this pose with the help of a yoga instructor. In the events of herniated disc, if you have herniated or slip disc, this pose can even make the condition worse. So one should avoid this pose or one should modify this pose with the help of experienced yoga instructor. In the events of hernia repair and abdominal surgery, if you are recovering from the post effects of hernia repair or abdominal surgery, 
one should avoid this pose until completely healed. In the events of pregnancy, especially in the later stages of the pregnancy, due to the twisting effect, a pregnant movement is advised to not practice this pose. It is advised to avoid deep twisting during the pregnancy. People who suffer from hypertension should avoid this pose. If you are suffering from high blood pressure, one should avoid this pose. The speed of this video is blocked at two times and that is of the actual video. So these are all the contraindications of practicing the Ardh Matsyendra Asana. So that is all for today on the cheese. I hope you people enjoyed this video. Make sure you watch my videos every day because I will be bringing a lot of yoga related content with the help of which you can get fit, stay healthy, stay happy and stay safe. Thank you for staying with me this long. I am gonna take your leave now. I will see you Amit Cheese in the next video. Until then, thank you and Namaste.